it is really incredible what can you do with tomatoes and eggplants oh my god there's so many cool dishes you can make with those beautiful vegetables and fruits boom boom shakalaka hello beautiful people guys today i'm gonna make a uh, dish called moussaka or called marmour so it's a very famous and popular dish in lebanon in my recipe i'm actually gonna bake the eggplant instead of frying them can you catch the eggplant by the way You can find a lot of sort of moussaka, marmour online. There's a lot of difference, by the way. My version of making this moussaka dish or marmour is absolutely wonderful. You know, in general, I really love dishes that are very simple and very Mediterranean in the same way. So using eggplant, the olive oil, the garlic, the onions, that's sexy. This is one of the simplest recipe you can make at home in only 20 minutes. So at first we require eggplant, salt, olive oil, plum tomatoes, chopped onions, chopped garlic, chickpeas, and tomato paste. Are you ready to make the moussa at home? Let's go! So first, we're gonna dice all the eggplant. We're gonna add a bit of salt, a bit of olive oil. We're gonna mix them all together, and then we're gonna add them in a tray, in a baking tray. Place them in the convection oven, and voila! The second step, we are gonna blanch the tomatoes. So at first, we're gonna grab the tomato, we're gonna make a sort of cross on the top of the plum tomatoes, and then we're gonna blanch them for around 10 minutes. We're gonna place them in a nice bath, and then we're gonna peel all the skin. That's so easy, right? Now we're gonna finally chop the tomatoes horizontally and vertically. One sec, one sec. Do not throw the skin of the tomatoes because we are gonna fry them and then we're gonna use them for decoration, all right? That's gonna be a bit more interesting. Third step, in a pan, on a medium heat, we're gonna add a bit of olive oil. We're gonna add the finely chopped onions, the garlic, we're gonna stir fry all of them until tender. We're gonna place the finely chopped tomatoes, the tomato paste. We're gonna mix them properly. I really remember when my mom used to make it and it was absolutely a wonderful dish. A bit of salt. Then we're gonna add the eggplants. Mix them again, we're gonna simmer them. Now, if you require a bit of water, you can add some water because you want to have a sort of stew texture, all right? And then we are gonna finalize the dish with a bit of chickpea. <laughs> Once the dish is finalized, you can place it in the chiller and basically we eat it as always in room temperature or cold. All right, let's talk about this dish. What I did is I added basically a eggplant, fried it, and then I added the moussaka on the top with a bit of mint, radish, and the fried tomatoes, which you can bake them as well at the same time. First of all, let's taste it and see how does it taste like. Ooh la 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 la! You can really feel a sort of olive oil, tomatoes, the garlic, the entire combination with the eggplant, which is a bit smoky. The Lebanese way of serving this dish is very basic. We just put it basically on a plate with a bit of olive oil on the top, and we always serve it with a Lebanese sort of pita bread. If you have any suggestions and you want me to make you a dish and to teach you all the steps how to make it, please leave me a comment below and let me know what would you like me to do. And I would be very happy to make it for you at any time. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you very soon with a new vlog or new recipe.